Hey guys, what is going on? Welcome to the Poker Resort, and we have more Coral Coral Leaks to be talking about, and these Coral Coral Leaks are going to be regarding Megalodios and Megalodios. Now, as you guys all know, they have, everyone, everyone knows about the Pokemon. This, this isn't new news, but there is news regarding what you can do with them, and what you can do with them is being able to fly through the sky, be able to ride on top of the Pokemon, and be able to battle all legendary Pokemon. Now, I'm just going to read what it says on Cerebi, is that you can fly on Mega Latias and La Latios in the overworld and find Pokemon such as Reshiram, Zekrom, Diagla, and Palkia in the sky. Latios is exclusive to Omega Ruby, and Latias is exclusive to Alpha Sapphire, just as it was back in Ruby and Self Sapphire. Um, the Eon ticket is said to return through a special distribution. This makes Latias available in Omega Ruby and Latias in Sapphire. Okay, still saying the same thing. The ticket will be distributed via serial code in an upcoming issue. The legendary Pokemon are found on islands that can only be found through areas on the sky and is said to make it all so non-event Pokemon will be available in Gen 6, such as legendary Pokemon. Um, you can access the sky the Eon Flute item, which we do not know how we will get yet, but I'm just going to assume it'll be something that'll be post-game after you already beat it. And then you can also encounter various other Pokemon in the wild within the clouds over Hoenn. Now what I think of this, I actually think this is really cool. Um, I feel like it's in, it's a step in the right direction, such as being able to use Pokemon to be able to like to fly, to surf, to dive, stuff like that. Because I want Pokemon to get to the point where we can pick any Pokemon we want that can use a specific HM to be able to see them using the move. That's what I want to see. Now, I'll be able to see these Pokemon fly. I'm going to assume you don't need to know the move fly, because, I mean, they're they're basically jets. They can fly whatever they want, whether or not they know the move. So, I think it is pretty cool that you'll be able to use one of these features. And another really cool thing is that you get to see, basically, the whole region from, from an aerial, aerial view, which I think is really, really nice to see. So, that's something I, I, I am definitely looking forward to. To be able to use it now because i know you were be were able to like be able to catch the pokemon on the water and everything so now that you can be able to ride over the water and be able to go see the different parts of the region is very cool and that's about all the news we have for the coral coral leaks for october now since this is basically the last one before the game comes out which we should be getting well i guess around the same time so around november 10th We'll be getting the next batch. I guess that's technically going to be the last batch that we will be getting of Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire. So they might be saving the best for last. So maybe we won't have to hear when's Mega Flygon going to be announced. So maybe that could be what everyone's been waiting for. This, so they specifically saved that for last. That's what I'm going to be thinking. Demo code. It did not come out for the U.S. yet, even though it will be coming out, I think, at the first for Japan. But we'll just have to wait and see for that. So, if you guys have anything else to if you guys want to add, what you guys think about the new features with Latias and Latios, let me know in the comment section below. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you guys next time.